A 1,200-pound relic from World War II is no more. A rocket detonated underwater a short time ago right off the Treasure Coast. And now's John Chaman is live for us in Indian River County with more on this. John? Well, Shannon, we are here at the excavation site, the construction site where this rocket was found on Monday. If you look behind me, you might be able to see the trail that the uh, equipment was needed to take the rocket out over the dune line and then out into the ocean. It was around 2.30 this afternoon uh, when the rocket was detonated. I talked to a couple of residents here in the Ocean Ridge neighborhood and they thought, well, maybe they'd get a bigger splash. Chopper 5, though, was overhead. Johan getting a great shot uh, as the 10-foot-long torpedo, a Tiny Tim rocket, was set off. Now, this area was used as a training ground for the Navy, and many live rounds were dropped. Now, this 75-year-old bomb found Monday again by a crew excavating this site for a new home. We had to uh, cut an opening in the dune line, and it had to be drug uh, mechanically off the, off the site and down to the water's edge. Now here's another angle of what it looked like from the beach. Now, unlike other ordnance that's been found in the area over the years, this was found on land and there were explosives in the nose. A sheriff's helicopter circled overhead to make sure that there was no sea life in the area before the okay was given to detonate that weapon. Sheriff's office evacuated dozens of homes for about three hours today, coming up uh, all new at five o'clock on News Channel 5. We will talk with some of the neighbors who had to clear out for a few hours today. We're live in Indian River County. I'm John Shaman for the now South Florida. John.